That's yep. a really good showing there for our Knoxville team. All right, outstanding. We're ready for our next bout, and, and that's what it is. Please help me welcome to the cage, DeAndre Hill. So DeAndre Hill versus Carson Heidel. Another battle of debuts in Muay Thai. This is in the featherweight division here in Aries Fight Series. And it's presented by Tranquility Hardscapes. Three two-minute rounds. So we'll talk about DeAndre Hill first. It's from the UFC gym, Murfreesboro, Tennessee. It's a good gym. Probably getting a lot of good looks, DeAndre Hill. DeAndre, man, DeAndre Hill going to the UFC gym in Murfreesboro. A lot of their guys, they got a lot of tough guys that come out of that gym. And, man, when you look at this, I mean, man, you know he's going to go in there. He's going to go in there and fight. Uh, he, he has a few guys, you know, in his corner that has fought here uh, multiple times here at the Cotton Eye Joe and here for Aries. So it's going to be really good to see. He's only 20 years old, 5'9", really young. Yep. Uh, so, so a lot to attest to. And, like I said, he's a debut, man. So... With these debuts, a lot of different things, uh, you never know. But it'll be fun to see how he comes out. I'm excited. Yeah. Comes out to a little Jay-Z as well. All right, back to our guy, Jeff. So here comes Carson Heidel from up the road, up Pellissippi Parkway, Oak Ridge, Tennessee. That is uh, from the Resolute Martial Arts Camp in Oak Ridge. Carson Heidel has worked with the likes of Cody Des Jordan, Chase Morales, and others, the so one-stripe white belt, and also making his debut. Carson Heidel, he, I mean, he's 21 years old, came in really relatively the same weight as uh, DeAndre. I mm -hmm. mean, this is gonna be interesting too, man. I mean, he looks solid, he looks good yep. coming into here. Both of these guys look really good. They look like they're in really good shape. Uh, so they're going to pack some power for some 145 hours. Uh, and they're both debuts. So most debuts, as we know from the history of us watching and being here, they come out swinging. So this is going to be a fun, fun Muay Thai bout, I, I suspect. And, and any time Tim Loy is involved in the matchmaking, even with Muay Thai, you know, even if you're not familiar with these guys, you know they're going to bring the action. Yes. I mean, that's the thing about, that's the beauty of Tim. I mean, this man picks up some incredible bouts. I mean, like, like this main event, but, <laughs> <laughs> but man, I mean, putting on, he, there's been multiple Muay Thai bouts of I've sat here and watched, and I'm like, man, I don't know a single one of these guys, but boy, do they deliver, and boy, they come and they throw down, and um, that's just the beauty of matchmaking, man, and I'm excited to see these two guys go. Two young guys, and we are ready to go. It's DeAndre Hill in the black trunks, blue glove, and shin tape, and opposed by Carson Heidel in the black trunks, red glove, and shin pad tape. And he makes his debut here tonight. He's representing the UFC gym, Murfreesboro, Tennessee. Let's hear it for DeAndre Hill. And his opponent, fighting out of the Knoxville Mortgage Brokers Red Corner. He is also making his debut right here tonight. He weighed in at 143 pounds. He represents Resolute System Martial Arts out of Oak Ridge, Tennessee. Let's hear it for Carson Heidel. Carson Heidel. Let's go. DeAndre Hill. He is put together. All right. Our second battle of the night, Muay Thai, presented by Tranquility Hardscapes. Jason Collins, our referee. Three two-minute rounds. Spectating fireworks here. Not the world-famous Cotton Eye Joe. <laughs> and there it is. On cue. Good body kick there from Heidel. It's Ferrara, Torres, Finney, Cage side for this one. Oh, good teeth straight to the right there from Heidel again. Well, look at the lower body on Heidel, man. He is put together all he the way put around. Together, man. He is put together. Oh, good left hook there from DeAndre. And right back again for a teeth. He got a little bit zealous. He saw he landed a great strike and got a little bit zealous, but hey. That was a really good hook there. Yeah. He, oh, good combination again. Oh, man, good combination again from DeAndre. Oh, good uppercut there from Heidel. Man. Heidel loves those uh, that rear teeth, I tell you. Yeah. <laughs> but Hill found the 
ear of Heidel as he was coming in, so he was ready to counter. Man, yes. Both guys, hands up. DeAndre. Form. Oh, man. Really some good strikes right there in the pocket from both. Oh, good wow. left hook again. Oh, oh good man. right. Oh. An uppercut there from DeAndre. Wow. Uh, another rear teep again. Oh, but good good check hook there from Heidel. Oh. Yep, got to stop, stop it. there. Boy, DeAndre, just a little subtle movement of the head before that little flurry. Yes, man. Boy, these guys look advanced for their age. They do. Good kick there to the body there from Heidel. Man. Oh, good there. Good leg kick again. Heidel, sorry, Torres. Heidel slowed down just a touch. Yeah, he has slowed down a little bit. I see, you see a little bruise there from that, them leg kicks. I don't know how much those legs are going to fit healed as well. He's taking a few as well. Yep. You do see a mark there. Oh, another leg kick. Like and right on the bruise. Down. Oh, <laughs> almost a teeth to the face. Well, Hill, good defense, man, to avoid some shots. Oh, oh, another leg kick. Wow, right. Those leg kicks are adding up. Those leg kicks are adding up, man. And some really good counter strikes there for DeAndre. But, man, I mean, Heidel got power, man. Yeah. I mean, he landed some great shots, too. That's a cold round. All right, That's take Take us to this replay here, Torres, man. Ooh. So you saw a few little wild flurries, I mean, debut, but man, that right hook right there that caught Heidel, and man, he put pressure on him, another, another teep, there again, saw to the body, um, you know, heel wasn't really, I thought heel got hit really hard there, but it looked like it was just more of a push. Mm -hmm. uh, he looks good, man, I mean, heel looks good. I, I, from, from what I've seen there, I mean, 10-9, I gotta give it to DeAndre. That was a close round. You know, at first, the way Heidel started out, you would have thought, okay, Heidel looked like he's in control, you know, solid. But those leg kicks started to add up. And then that counter left hook, like you said, when he was coming in, I think it affected him uh, throughout the rest of that round. So, we'll see. So, would you would you give that round to Hill then? I would give that round to Hill. Okay. I say 10-9 Hill. That's close. It's close. Yeah. I, it's, that's not, it's not a definitive. It's close. Right. Uh, I can see 10-9 either way, but I, I lean 10-9 Hill. Uh, those leg kicks started to add up, and that, those counter strikes, man, they, they were the more damaging, I feel. Well, we'll see if Heidel comes charging in like he did to start round one. And he does. Yes, he does. <laughs> <laughs> on the starting blocks. Another leg kick. Those leg kicks are adding up. Mm. Oh, now he has to. Oh, now they in the pocket just throwing. And All those pocket. landed. Yes, they did. Heidel threw some really good combinations there. Oh, now he's starting to catch some of those leg kicks, but even after that land, oh, really good punch over the top from Hill. Boy, that, that front leg by Heidel oh. just took another one. It's <laughs> it's getting purple. Yes, you can see the you can see the redness there from uh, Heidel on his left leg. And, and that's that's so, oh good so, body kick. And that's so smart for a guy that's charging in. You want to attack that lead leg, right? Yes, you want to attack that lead leg. And you saw Heidel did a little. You know, being, being on his body, saying those kicks don't mean nothing. Oh. Back to being aggressive. Okay, let's see what we got here. Do we have a count? Do we have a count? Do we have a count? I don't really see a count. I don't think it was a count. No, it was not. It was not a count. All right, interesting. I haven't really seen Heidel change stances. Oh, oh he took another one. God. Oh, 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 a few, a few hook got in. Yeah, Hill loves that counter, man, when yes, Heidel's charging in. He does, he loves the counter when he's charging in. Corner wanting uh, aggression and forward movement from Heidel. Oh, good combination there from Heidel. 15 seconds left in the round. Oh, good kick there to the right. Heidel, Heidel starting to, oh. Big deep breaths from oh. Heidel. Heidel's turning, uh, Heidel's got his back on the cage. Not a, oh, good, good left there. From, now, the cage hmm. switches. He's moving, Heidel got the pressure on him. Oh, he landed back. oh, oh, wow. they're, they're throwing in the pocket. What a flurry. Oh, no, that's 10 seconds. I thought that was. Yep. Oh, good hook right there from both. Oh, good job. Good combination there again from Hill. There it is. 
That's close. That's close. Ooh, that's close. That's close, man. That's close, man. I don't know. All right. Ooh. Take us through this, see what you think. So you see him pull back right there, a right, moving his head, good head, moving a little bit about it from DeAndre. But, oh, right there, that right straight down the middle, came back with a left hook, missed the uppercut. But, man, he started going hard to the body, and then, boom, that little check hook, but then, man, <laughs> the left hook came back with heel. Um, this is a uh, I, I, I don't know. Uh, second round, thank God I'm not a judge. Man, <laughs> if I had to pitch, uh, I'm, I'm going to go a Heidel. I'm going to say a Heidel got it barely. But I'm going to say because of the control of the cage, they both landed really good shots. I could easily see this fight one-to-one -one going into the next round. I think it's close enough to where that would probably be the fairest thing. Yeah. Uh, Hill might have edged that second round out too. Oh, well, yeah, it's close. It yeah, was close. Absolutely. Ooh. But it's one of those things where it could be lopsided oh, to nothing, and then really, in reality, the totality of the fight, it, there's not much difference there's between There's not the much two. difference, no. You, I 100% agree. So we'll see how these two guys come out here in the third round where the gas tank is. Yeah. Oh, good teep there from Hill. Now you see Hill walking forward. See, that little subtle movement. Oh, oh what a head kick. Good Clean. head kick. <laughs> Look at Heidel. Oh, and Heidel said, man, yeah, he said he can take that. But, man, that little subtle movement, you know, where he catches and caught the teeth again. Well, uh, Heidel will make that little jump like he's going to do a teeth or a push kick. It's enough to take control and control the forward pressure there. You know so what? Then it puts heel on his back foot. Leg kick there again. Hoddle's reaction maybe you have have some psychological usefulness, but man, that head kick still counts. Yeah, that head kick. Yeah, you're right. You might say you can take it, but it counts on the scorecard. Yep. Oh, good knees there. Oh, he's trying to just punch to the body. Good knee to the body. Those yeah. inside the clinch punches are big, man. Big deep breath from Hoddle. Oh, oh, another leg kick. Yeah, Heidel's catching some of those oh. tours, but it's after contact. It is after contact. I mean, it's after the fact. Now, if he was catching them and really putting some damage on him after taking them, right. then that would be different. But, I mean, he's got to make sure he pays for every kick. Make him pay for that kick, like right there. Yeah. Make him pay. Good. Good right there from Heidel. There, there you go. You got to make him pay for every kick. But, man, I mean, Hill, Hill is trying to stop. Oh, good left hook there. Oh, another kick and another one. Short little compact shot landed by Hill. Final seconds, that's and that's fight. the end of the round and the fight. Yeah. That's a good fight. Hug that out. That is well-deserved. Man. That's a good fight. <laughs> that's a good fight. For them to be two debuts, that was, yeah. that was a great fight. I, I see. Obviously, you can't tell their wrestling ability from watching them do Muay Thai. But, man, I see MMA fighters, like, their frame, their mentality, the mentality, the intangibles, just – the technique. But take us through this replay here. Yes, I, I agree with you, Ben. Uh, these, these are some future MMA guys, no doubt. Uh, man, these two guys just went at it. I mean, you see, like I said, that subtle movement. But, oh, that head kick, especially with the lead leg there um, from heel, man. That was, uh, that was, that was really, really, that's really good. And then the reaction from the high to it makes me wonder why the corners aren't allowed in yet. All right, there you go. All right, so yeah. the corners are now in. Yeah. <laughs> that was interesting. You had the ring girl. Yeah, the ring girl was in before the corner man was in. <laughs> Tessa. So we got Tessa and Bonnie. Tessa's in there right now. Working Aries Fight Series 3 tonight. So hopefully Jason Collins worked that one. And Jimmy Neely, Luke Wilson handling things tonight. As our referees, these tours Finney, I am Vince Ferrara. We are your cage side commentary team. I think we'll have some guests that will join us here cage side throughout the night. And then, of course, things will be capped off tonight with our main event, Trevor Peak versus David Ruthless Robbins. Welterweight title on the line. The first Aries Fight Series championship could be handed out 
tonight in our main event battle of undefeated fighters. All right, go to the judges' scorecards. Let's get an official decision. Here's Jeff. Ladies and gentlemen, we are headed to the judges' scorecards. All three judges scored this the same for your winner by unanimous decision. And in the blue corner, DeAndre Hill. And uh, rightfully so, I do agree. I, I, I thought DeAndre did enough to win that. Uh, they probably did give him that uh, second round. Mm -hmm. Uh, as you were saying, because that second round was really close. It was yeah. really close. Uh, but DeAndre Hill, I mean, really good fights. Landed some really clean shots. The leg kicks did start to add up.